Hello everyone, welcome back. Let's go borrow a pot from our asshole guardian. Huh? You better wash it. You know, in fact, you better buy me a new pot because you touched this one. Uh, I mean... I mean, do you want to join us? Alright. Get your stinking adult eyes off of her. This guy, man. Like, on one hand, we are living under his roof. On the other, you don't have to be such a... segment of our show. After his last appearance was so well received, we decided to bring back this fine gentleman today. It's the high school detective, Goro Akechi. This tastes a bit bland. But I'm relieved. A lot's happened, but it seems your grades haven't dropped. <laughs> School's been going fine. I'm more worried about you, sis. Are you tired? You're probably lacking sodium. Do I seem so? But, hypothetically speaking, if these phantom thieves are real, I believe they should be tried in a court of law. That's quite the statement. Are they committing crimes? Some people even say that the thieves are actually helping their victims abandon their evil ways. What the artist Madarame did truly was an unforgivable crime. However, they're taking the law into their own hands by judging him. It is far from justice. More importantly, you should never forcefully change a person's heart. Is it a crime to manipulate someone's heart? <laughs> I love how everybody has these serious conversations about taking the heart away, manipulating someone's heart, and changing it. I don't think these are the conversations of normal people watching a TV show like this. They'd be like, what is this crazy sci science fiction shit? Depending on the means, yes. He's absolutely right. Like, who- have any of you ever sat around the dinner table and someone would just ask you out to be like, Well, do you think it's okay to change a person's heart? Even if it what? makes someone admit their evil deeds and helps make them pay for their crimes? Why the sudden interest? It's nothing. Do you believe that these allies of justice exist? What? Oh, of course not. You don't need to think about such unnecessary things. You understand what I'm trying to say, right? Study hard and go to a prestigious college. Moving up in the world is difficult as a woman. Yet you can't do much if you don't have the authority. I'll use every method necessary to make it happen. All you need to do is remain focused on what must be done now for your future's sake. Sorry. <sighs> now... Yes? Mm-hmm, it's fine. Oh, that case. What must be done? Justice. If those phantom thieves are out there helping people, what the root for them, no questions asked. What's up with that reverb? What do I want? Or the to echo, do? whatever. What do you want to do, Makoto? Do you want to join us? I'm guessing that's where this is all leading. Do you want to be me and I'll be you? Oh, I am thou. Delicious, Lady On. I'm sure you'll make a wonderful bride some. Mm. <sighs> Sorry, I'm gonna have to borrow the sofa. Oh my God! What's wrong, Yusuke? We haven't finished our meal. What about the porridge, or even udon? 
I thought they were gonna try and look up Anne's skirt. That's why I was like, wait, what? Just leave it for next time, man. <sighs> She's asleep already? It'd be weird if she wasn't tired. We should let her sleep. Why, why would that be weird? By the way, Ryuji, how do you know On? Huh? Oh, we went to middle school together. What was Lady On like back then? Not so different from now. Once we got to high school, we ended up in different classes and stopped talking. I don't think she had many friends. I mean, she grew up overseas. Plus, there's her looks. The popular kids hate her, the quiet ones stay away. I see. Can you fall asleep with your head resting on your hands like that? So, what about you two? When your muscles relax and then <laughs> your, your head with the couch? Us? This is a great opportunity to get to know each other better. You know every detail of my past at this point. It's only fair you tell me every detail of yours. So you got nothing to lose, huh? All right, I'll tell you. It's just a normal story about a rotten kid, though. My dad left when I was young. Oh, Ever Jesus. since then, it's just been me and my mom. I was actually trying to get a track scholarship so I could make things easier for her. In the end, I just screwed it all up. Turns out I'm a pretty bad son, huh? <laughs> Back when I was a first year, my mom got called out to school for me raising my hand at Kamoshida. All the teachers kept hounding her for what I did, but she just stayed quiet through it all. <sighs> I'll never forget the look she had on her face, though. On the way home, she, uh, she apologized to me for being a single mom and all. So that's what happened. They say at school that everyone is equal, but in reality, that's a gross oversimplification. I understand how you feel. Well, when it comes to getting labeled, nobody's got it worse than this guy. Yep. Is this about his past? Now that I think about it, we never have heard the details. Ah, oh, you know, save a lady from getting raped by some stranger, end up going almost to prison, and then getting yelled at by Sojiro for like months and months. Yeah. Simple, typical shit. How dare I? Damn brat! I'll sue! If you keep this up, then I'll report about the money. Is that fine with you? Wait, what? All I have to say is that you did it on your own. And it's over. But... I just did as I was told. Who do you think I am? No! Hey, make this statement to the cops. This kid suddenly attacked me. Got it? If you even Wait, try man. to say anything else, you know what'll happen to you, right? Huh? But... This is Shut bullshit. Up. You're done for. All right, this is what you do, buddy. Hit him in the throat. That's all I got. Dump, dump his body somewhere after that. You're gonna learn what happens when you cross me. Excuse me, folks. We received a complaint about an argument here. Is something the matter? Oh, it's you, sir. So what happened? Explain it to the good officer. Ma'am, I just saved you. I j literally just saved that you. That young man suddenly attacked him. You... He shoved this gentleman to the ground. Piece of shit. And this man got injured. I... am upset it's with you right she now. says. Also, make sure you deal with this so my name isn't mentioned at all. You understand what that means, correct? Yes, sir. Hey, cop him. Understood. Okay, so now that makes sense as to why everybody's treating me like shit. Because... Just listening to it pisses me off. She didn't stand up for us. God damn it! You got an assault on your record just for that. The woman sounds quite horrible as well. 
She stayed quiet this whole time. Yes, Yusuke. That man is just the kind of person whose heart we should steal. Who is he? And where can we find him? Which one of these three options that say the same thing do I wish to choose? Um, I mean, two of them even begin with I don't. Well, it was pretty dark, man. I don't know. You can't remember, huh? No. Well, it was at night, and I'm sure you were in shock after getting arrested. I understand all too well the pain of not being able to remember important details of your life. The victim's personal information is always kept secret. Identifying that man will prove difficult. Besides, the courts already made their ruling, didn't they? Even if we manage to give revenge, his past record won't go away. I can't stand it! This world is so messed up! The weak are left to fight for themselves while rotten adults get away with whatever they want! And those in power don't do anything to help the situation. Can't we fix this, though? Nobody would even know. We just need to show the world what true justice is. We'll make them come to their senses. You're right, Yusuke. That's gotta yeah. be what our powers are for. Sounds good to me. The flashier our missions are, the cooler we end up looking. You've all taught me so much. What are you guys getting all excited about? Oh, sorry. Did we wake you up? Nah, not really. I've been up for a while now. Still, this weird feeling came over me while I was listening to you guys. Oh. It almost feels like I've known you all forever. Okay. Do you think it's because our backgrounds are so similar? Did you help somebody from getting raped and then it turned around on you? Well, it sure ain't because of anything good. Did you get your leg broken by a volleyball coach like Ryuji? Did your mother basically get murdered by a wannabe artist like Yusuke? Similar, huh? Are you I'm a cat? The one who doesn't fit in. Hmm? I don't have any past to look back on. No memories. Just give Morgana some catnip, he'll be fine. What do you mean? We could search the whole world and we wouldn't find a bigger misfit than you. And the reason we're going to Mementos is to get your memories back, right? I'm sure your past will be just as troubled as ours. No doubt. Hm. We'll see about that. I actually feel like I've known Morgana for a really long time, too. It's so strange. I can't really put it into words. Look, I I'm helping you guys out for my own sake. Don't get me wrong. If you don't get stronger, investigating mementos won't be anything but a pipe dream. That sure was a quick turnaround. One second you're depressed, the next you're acting all tough. All joking aside, let's take this seriously. We should go as far with it as we can. I want to punish those corrupt adults and give courage to people in trouble. Only we can do that. Ha! <laughs> you can say that again. Being a member of the Phantom Thieves will surely help me grow, both as an artist and as a person. Of course. You're under my tutelage, after all. There's nothing we can't accomplish. Well, I hope we can keep this up. We should be all right with you as our leader. Whoa, it's this late? I guess now's a good time to call it for the night. Oh, that reminds me. The owner said you're free to crash here, Yusuke. That's very kind of him. Well, you haven't spent a morning here yet. You convinced him, didn't you? You go, Miss Older Dude Charmer. What kind of nickname is that? A bad one. I won't be able to sleep unless I take a bath. There's a bathhouse nearby, so you can go there. I won't be able to join you, though. Oh, that sounds great. I want to come, too. How about you, Juan? You guys go on ahead. I should get going. Well, good night, Morgana. Damn it. I need to turn back into a human soon. <laughs> I can't let her get taken by someone else. Oh, my goodness. Morgana, you're already in the friend zone. Don't... You're not going to get out of it. <sighs> Huge bathtubs really are the best. On's missing out. 
It's a bit hot, though. Look at that creepy old dude just messing with the water back there. He's like, if I turn this hotter, maybe it'll force those young boys out and I can... Oh, old guys like That's what he's thinking about. Reason. See, look! Yeah. See, look! Look! You know, I've been wondering... Y'all thought I was crazy! Now. But what do you think about Odd? As a girl, I mean. Odd, that's not what I meant. Come on, can't you act a little more like a guy our age? Doesn't she at least look better than a celebrity? I'll be sure to share what you've said with Odd. No, oh, please don't. Seriously? That aside, we need to hurry and find our next target. About that, though, is targeting famous people enough? Seeing people's reactions these days has been making me think twice about what we do. True. Pursuing only what's best in the short term may end up becoming fruitless for us. He really wants that hot. We need a strategy to appeal to the public. Oh? Well, what do you got in mind? Do I look like someone who could come up with such a thing? I was an idiot for asking. I'm more like the charge commander, and Morgana's a specialist of that world. Hmm. Oh, whoops. Ah, it's freaking hot! How much do you have to add until you're satisfied, Gramps? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Now he's gonna look Gramps, around. I can't stand it anymore! Also, Ryuji's kind of over. Anyways, let's exaggerating meet this. up again early next week. I'll, uh, I'll contact everyone. But yeah, that was a perverted old man back there. Oh shit! Right, yeah, we're sharing this room now. Hi, um, Did friend. Happen? Not you two, no. Both of you are gonna tell me to go to sleep. Whoa! I wonder who hey. you're talking about. We pulled you in here so we can smack you around, inmates. The prisoner has returned. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Oh, I just. Oh. The bonds that you have reeled in are quite intriguing. In other words, they all have been unfairly labeled by society and are standing up against such fates. Have you noticed? Your heart seems to inspire theirs. <laughs> Outcasts of society. In other words, you're picaresque. Deepen your bonds with them. What? I have never heard someone use that word. I've never heard anyone speak that word before. Those will become the strength behind your rehabilitation. I look forward to it. Igor is that person who studies dictionaries during the day and they'll just come out and just throw some random word that obscure word that no one uses to look um, like he's more intelligent than you. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May you continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. And then when you ask him what that word is, he's like, <laughs> well. Let me break it down for you. The first part of this is a Latin root word of the... I'm like, God. I'm sure some of you have friends like that. All right. It's almost time. Sai-san's younger sister, correct? How are you allowed in this school? May I talk to you for a moment? 
Is it about the Phantom Thieves, Akechi-kun? You are quite perceptive. I was wondering if there were any points in common between Kamoshida's and Madarame's cases. He doesn't actually go to class here, right? There have been victims, after all. The Phantom Thieves need to be pursued. You criticize the Phantom Thieves, yet you don't doubt their actual existence. Oh, you saw that show on TV. Common sense can get in the way at times when pursuing the truth. Many details become logical if I think on the premise that they do exist. No, the reason he thinks the Phantom Thieves is is because he goes to the other world. Yet he's gonna be like, oh, well, I'm is a this catchy. Because my sister told you to do so? It was just a coincidence. Why do I get the feeling that you're enjoying this? Because he has a smile on his face. You may be right. Huh? Phantom thieves that use calling cards and succeed in their crime? As the so-called charismatic detective, it'd be hard for me not to see them as my rival. What? You have such high self-esteem. So the Phantom Thieves are evil, and you are just? Compared to people who manipulate others' hearts as they see fit, I believe I'm on the side of justice. Besides, I'm only using my natural-born talents for the sake of serving the world. Ugh. Ugh. I just despise so many people in this game. Don't you think the same about yourself, too? This smug motherfucker. I... That's surprising. So you're just the good girl type of pushover. Oh. Punch him in the dick. Oh, looks like it's starting soon. See you later. Give Sai-san my regards. I'm not exactly sure what this guy's done, but he's had it done something that deserves it. Come on, Makoto, just punch me. Oh, just All right, Why does everyone get on my case? I don't know, Makoto. It's such a delight to enjoy coffee of this quality. You could stay until you find a place, you know. I can't promise it'd be comfortable here, though. Why are you so nice to him, but not to me? Thank you, but I'll return to the dorms. I realized something after talking with everyone last night. Perhaps it's due to my upbringing, but I don't know anything of the world, let alone other people. If I'm to depict people in my art, I need to learn more about them. I must interact with them more. I'll return to the dorms and start over by talking with the people closest to me. I see. Good on you for realizing that yourself. There's no need to exaggerate. May I come again sometime to enjoy your coffee? My doors are always open. He's been through a lot, too, from what I've heard. Are you related to him? Huh? Oh, uh... How would I describe it? We're just acquaintances, not family or anything. Yeah, kind of weird, right? I may be overstepping my bounds, but why did you decide to take him in? My reason, huh? <laughs> Probably because he reminds me of my old self. That's all? It doesn't take much when someone takes consideration on someone else. Your art instructor, um, former art instructor, he must have felt something for you, too. Besides just stealing your talents. Truth be told, I cannot hate him from the depths of my heart, either. What? I should probably get going. That dude killed your mother. Hey, you sure about this? The painting, I mean. It'd be a waste to keep here. Even if I kept it at the dorms, it'd only be met with skepticism. I doubt it would want that. Adding a hint of color to an otherwise ordinary day. I'm sure my mother would have done the same. I see. I'll hold on to it for you then. Thank you for the coffee. I'll come again. Hey! Well, bye, Yusuke.
<laughs> Don't sell it. Okay. He really wanted that porch. Hey, hey. Sure, let's look into it. We got more items. Hold on. Okay, so she wants to see us. All right. She belongs to. Uh, she's death, right? Back alley doctor. Okay, do we have a death persona? We do, the Matador. Okay, yeah, let's go see her then. I want to try and get the most out of these visits, so... Um, I guess we can just walk out there. Oh, that pompous ass. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Interesting shirt. Casual five kilometer run. Okay. What? I'm grateful. Yeah. I mean, I bought that for you, right? We captured her heart. Okay. I'm grateful. Ah, you're back. Damn, now I feel like I need to go out there and buy all those gifts. Sunday, oh, wait, Sunday is a teacher day, right? It's Friday and Sunday, right? Which one is she? Temper, oh no, wait, Arcana. We do not have, wait, wait, no. Wait, is it Temper? Oh, yeah, 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 my bad, it is Temper, okay. So let's go oh. spend a ton of money. Actually, hold on. Before that, I've been meaning to stop by uh, Shibuya again and Airsoft Shop. Hey! I don't have enough guts, man. Let's try to... huh? All right. Sounds good. Okay, so nothing really new. All right. Never mind. Uh, come again. <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> oh. Um. Oh, Saturday. Hi. Whoops. Okay. Well, shit. Okay, so Sojiro. What are you? Hierophant, right? Son of a bear. Hierophant, huh? Okay. Well. Oh, there's this guy too. Which one are you? Hmm. 
We don't have Moon either. Hmm. Let's go see if Anne is around too. Well, you know what? No, we'll hang out with Silly Girl. Let's just go and grab a Hierophant, I guess. A cheap one, hopefully. Hello. Hey, inmate. God. I don't like you. Huh? Time for some re finished for now. Justine, you these are the paths. You okay, walk. by Arcana. This persona? You'll withdraw this persona? I guess. This is your power. It's kind of expensive, but... Can I? I can't go in the menus here, can I? Shit. Read here. Well... We have a fool. I think I got rid of Nekotama, so we don't have a magician. Ah, I'll just come back here later. Are you finished? Right, that's all I wanted. It Thanks. is time, inmate. Thank you. Hello. You got time right now? Damn it. All right then. Thanks. Even with that persona, is that even worth it? The money I spent on it then? Hi. Ah, oh, punch this dude. Get the fuck out of my face. Yes. Ah, uh, kids these days. I'm not, I don't, I don't, I have no idea. The government. Exactly. No way. I don't know anything about the Japanese currency. You know, we have not had Miss Kawakami's class yet. Since oh. I wait, there's no reports of a lost item 
so she wants you to start filling out some paperwork. Ah, uh, poor Miss hey. Kawakami. I don't know. Is that that piece of shit? Oh my god. Is that a fast travel spot? No. They said third floor, right? Next to the library? Hello? Earlier than expected. Have a seat. I'll get straight to the point. Mr. Kamashida and Madarame. Won't you tell me the truth behind the Phantom Thieves incidents? Can't answer that? Oh, of course. There's no way you would admit to such things. Have a listen. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. Fucking God. Why is Ryuji on our team? Like... Why is Mishima on our team? And that's it. Like, I can deal with Morgana and, and Yusuke now, but... Oh, God. So you think it's true? It won't we'll be right okay now. if Just... we keep doing this, right? Uh... What could all this mean? I don't know. Ryuji, he's crazy. He got hit in the head too many times. We screwed up. Stop talking. She can hear them meowing. Was it blackmail? Hypnosis? How do you corner someone into making them confess? Won't you tell me how you did it? I have no idea. You want to say that this doesn't prove anything, don't you? I believe that you three are the Phantom Thieves. It proves that there's an idiot who thinks he's a Phantom Thief. Now. What would the police think if they heard my recording? It'd be bad if we're put under police surveillance. This is a, this is a dangerous line, Makoto. There's no telling what'll happen to you, too. If you confess the truth, I don't mind just leaving this between the two of us. You'll tell me, won't you? that time would just be wasted. Go ahead. Hey, where are you at? Taking a uh. lead. <laughs> Let's meet up at the usual spot to hold our Phantom Thieves meeting. I fucking hate this guy so much. I... That idiot! Uh. As loud as always. But his timing's perfect. He's always the one blabbing about everywhere. It doesn't matter where we are. We could be in the police station. She's like, man, I really can't wait to find a target because we're the Phantom Thieves. You hear that, everybody? We're the fucking Phantom Thieves. I'd like everyone else to hear this as well. Well, bring him around the lunchroom every day because I'm sure Ryuji will Won't fucking you take just... take me to your friends? I guess it can't be helped now. He is the worst. Oh. Hmm? Here? Is that girl a friend of yours? She's gonna have to be now. What the hell? Yeah, what the hell, Ryuji? What's the meaning of this? I had him lead me here. Ryuji Sakamoto. On Takamaki. And you're Kitagawa-kun, correct? Second year at Kosei High and former pupil of Madarame? I wanted to ask you all about this. 
If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. An extremely similar technique was used for both Kamashita and Matarame, while those affected by their acts were just coincidentally meeting up. How could that not raise suspicions? What do you intend to do? Have you come just to say you're going to report us? I bet someone told you to find us. The school can't have ties to criminals after all. And yet they turn a blind eye when it comes to suicide and sexual harassment. Those adults are just using you. I feel sorry for you. Uh, I... I know. Huh? That's why I would like to verify the justice you speak of. What? I'm the only one who knows about you. If you prove what you're doing is just, I'll erase this. She wants to make a deal. Look, she's smart. She's on board. Let's kick Ryuji out. And we'll be fine. Get rid of Mishima. There is someone whose heart I'd like you to change. Who? Hmm. So you're not saying it's impossible. However, I cannot tell you that just yet. Let's continue our talk after school tomorrow. On the roof. Assuming you accept my offer, that is. <sighs> this is turning into a real pain. Yeah, I wonder why, Ryuji. I wonder if... God, I just want to dive into this game and just... Fucking... You were careless. I don't think you truly understood how high the stakes were. Anything to say, Ryuji? Why are you singling me out? On got recorded too, you know? I'm so sorry. Hey, what should we do? That girl's got dirt on us. A recording seems to be insufficient evidence, though. And even with that, there's no way they could prove our methods. Considering who we're dealing with, I think it might be a trap. Regardless, this guy would be in real trouble. He's on probation, after all. Things would get rough if we didn't have our leader. And I totally don't want to deal with the police. Then you should then stop yelling. We have no other choice but to go along with it. Yes, it's best we agree, at least for the time being. We made a crucial mistake, but not a critical one. We'll just have to recover from here on out. Like, Ryuji's character, I think, is supposed to be kind of like, um, what was Persona's for? Was it Sasuke? It was the first guy you met. He, his father, I think, owned the Juness or whatever. I think Ryuji's supposed to be kind of like him. But I remember liking Sasuke a lot more. Was, that his name? was it Sasuke? Whatever that guy's name was. Yeah, yeah. My bad. Ryuji's just like this one trick... I was gonna say one trick pony. They're like this one path character. He just he's the guy who yells and he's you know, I'm the idiot and So, we doing this? I, just, I, don't, I don't really like it. I like Captain Kid though. All right. We're meeting on the school rooftop tomorrow, yeah? What about me? I could always sneak in if necessary. That'll draw too much attention. You should just wait outside, Yusuke. What could she be scheming? <laughs> That's all he is! He's, got, he's in a 100% state of rage and being upset at everything. And it's just so tired. First thing that he says. He's just always piss. Where have you been? Been searching all along. He's the person who freaks out like when he asks for a burger with no pickles, and then they still give him the pickles, and he just freaks out and like returns the burger or some shit. Masquerade, hiding both face and mind. 
all free for you to draw. I'm a chef, chef too. Every time I hear this song, I imagine this lady on a stage with a spotlight on her in a very sparkling long dress. A purple dress. Like a very classy singer, you know? It's a cool song. Very mellow. But has it got annoying yet? We've heard it for... Well, maybe it has for one, some of hey. you, but for me, it hasn't. And this is not the type of music I usually listen to, but uh, there's just something about it. just like, man, I like it. I was not paying attention to what Morgana just said. My bad. Moments of Nothing left to be found. Oh, we need to meet on the school roof, right? Hey! Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, let's go to sleep. It's time for that. Since it's raining, we should stop by the diner. Or is it not going to be raining anymore? Damn it! Hey! Oh, right! later I guess oh I've been meaning to go find the politician I was thinking too. you might not show I keep forgetting about that guy so whose heart do you want us to change a mafia boss uh, oh, oh, okay mafia what are you talking about that's what they call themselves this group seems to be the cause of the rise in fishing scams what's worse once you're in their sights, they won't stop threatening you until they get what they want. They'll force you to take part in their scams, threaten your family, and ultimately destroy your life. Holy shit. It appears that their victims include some of our students. No! They primarily target juveniles. What's the boss's name? Nobody knows. The victims are being threatened not to testify. So even the police can't get a grasp of the situation. That's where you want us to start? You should be able to pull it off. If you're really the righteous phantom thieves. <laughs> or is Akechi-kun correct when he says you act without justice? Can't you say something witty back at her? Mm, yeah, no. Why are you being so serious? Their main hub of activity is in Shibuya. That's all the information I have. You have two weeks. Once that is passed, I'll submit all the evidence I have to the police and to the school. I hope you don't let me down. She really had the upper hand in that exchange. No one is nice, man. I mean, she'll eventually become nice after we do this mission and then she'll join our party. But before that happens, like, everyone's just such a jerk. Come on, we should get in touch with Yusuke. Council president from Chujin Academy? Yeah. Are you saying that Makoto was sticking her nose into this phantom thief business? <sighs> Why would Makoto? 
bringing up my sister to upset me, are you? It seems there's no limit to your duplicity. Hmm. Fine. I'll listen to everything you have to say before I decide the truth of your statements. This is a long conversation. I'm so mad. The Mafia. Hmm. Can we really do this? <clears throat> Either way, we have almost no information on our target. This guy's a crime boss, so I wouldn't be surprised if he had a palace. Still. Isn't this a prime opportunity for us, though? How? We are in huge trouble! Even after we punished an evil man who seemed to be good, the public did not acknowledge us. However, if we take down an actual criminal, let alone a target the police don't have answers for... Oh, right! That might make people believe in us. I get it. That means even a catch you'll have to acknowledge us as the Phantom Thieves. What do you say, leader? I say, aha! Is this our chance? Hell yeah! We just gotta do what we always do. Our time limit is two weeks, correct? We can't afford to waste too much time. I'll ask around Kosei and see if there are any victims. Okay, I know some girls who go to Shibuya pretty often. I'll check with them about it. Alright, and I'm gonna see what I can find on the net. I'm gonna walk down the street and listen in on random conversations. That leaves our school up to you and Morgana. Or, I mean our school. You figured out what to do during the whole Kamoshida thing, right? I'll back you up. Speaking about school, I still need to go to the front gates. Oh, man. Alright, let's get back together at the end of the week once we've got all our info. I'll get in touch with you guys later. Tell the truth. I think this is all going to go around to him asking me to ask Anne to pose nude for him. I think this is where this is headed. No, it, it's probably not. But that would be funny if it was. Look over there at the Sayori. Now imagine that picture as actually a naked Anne.
Oh. Does he want to paint us nude? Paint me like one of your French girls, you just care. I'm in your debt. I bring a knife. Leave it to me. Without grasping it, the real question to be asked Where have I been? I'm a chef chef too. I close masquerade. Hide in my hey. face and mind. All free for you to grow. Am I allowed to leave? Yes, we are. Alright, so let's go. Study. Yeah, that dude. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. I can't go to the front of the school, but I may be able to catch that politician. Also, this lottery stand. Hi. Yeah. Well then. Oh man, let's go with the middle one. Oh man. Fuck. Oh man. Okay. Well. Shit is rigged. Okay, so is he underground? Also, is this reset? Oh, well, not not that one. Can you switch? Can oh, all right. So is that reset from P4? Is that supposed to be referenced? Because she really does look like reset. Hmm. Look at this dude. I'm just going to end this episode here then, and we'll go and probably study. Hmm. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Take care.